The sun's shining. That means we're going for a walk. Are you ready for a walk? Are you ready to go for a walk outside? Okay. He wasn't ready. The second we got outside, he fell asleep. <laughs> oh well. So I've been seeing a lot of misinformation and information about the coronavirus going around. And I'm definitely no expert on this topic. And neither are a lot of you. But I just am confused at the fact that people are treating this so crazy. Like it's starting to affect businesses, it's starting to affect just every way, right, I mean, everyday, you know, ways of life. We are starting to blow it out of proportion. Um, I'm not going to spout out any facts or spout out any kind of knowledge that I've done for my own self-learning um, on this topic, but what I would do is suggest that you do some of your own. Look at some of the things that people are saying is so bad about it. Look at some of the things that people are saying is not so bad about it, but most importantly, look to what the experts are saying. Um, I think that's gonna help save a lot of time as far as where you spend your time and brain power. It's gonna save you some money on not stocking up on supplies that you do not need to stock up on. And it's gonna help you not spread more misinformation about what is happening with the coronavirus because I feel like it's starting to get out of hand. Uh, I wasn't too old or too young when SARS came about, but it feels like the same thing. SARS, swine flu, whatever you want to call it, like these different sicknesses pop up and they affect people who, you know, are living their life in any kind of way, but like they're not deadly to a lot of people. Uh, going back to coronavirus, the people who are dying from this, I would say look into that because it's gonna help you understand how severe it can be for you as a person who is watching this YouTube video. So like I said, I'm not gonna go into so much information, but I would just say go out there and find out for yourself, educate yourself in different ways and just what you're seeing on social media. I really think it'll be beneficial to you and anyone that you talk to about the subject. You don't need to become an evangelist for either side. Just educate yourself and know what is going to be best for you and for those around you. Hey neighbor. I'm going to be on your vlog. No, I want to talk to you. I was on vlog six already. Yeah. You got like three new clients off it, right? Oh yeah. Not off the vlog. <laughs> We're on a target run and so far I'm guessing people think that toilet paper and Tylenol is the cure for coronavirus. Yeah, what's on your mind? I hope that all the people that came and raided the household items and canned goods also wash their hands because that's actually what's going to help them. They just started washing their hands, so right? they're, they're like, good to go. That's new to them. So like if you have coronavirus, are you just going to shit your life out? <laughs> I guess. You see all the toilet paper. Oh my god. Wow. In my face. Mm-hmm. It's gonna save us from coronavirus. It's not gonna make me happy as